Boom. What's up, Money Geeks? Mr. V here. Welcome to another video. In today's video, I want to talk to you guys about the infrastructure bill that I just uh, went through Congress. So before we actually jump into it, if you're new to the channel, we talk about how to earn money, how to save money, how to invest and build wealth. So that's something that interests you. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content. So this might be a little bit late of a video. I actually recorded a video over the weekend on Saturday because of the bill that passed last Friday. And I was going to post that video um, when it got to me editing the video. I realized that there were some parts in there where my microphone was malfunctioning. So the videos I recorded were useless because um, you can see me talking, but there was no audio. So I got really, really mad. So I just, like, I'm not going to just do it again over the weekend. So um, I, this is a little bit too late. So I just want to put that out there. But uh, I don't think it's too late because the momentum is just picking up uh, as far as what we, we want to talk about today. So I'm going to jump um, right here on my screen and I'm going to show you guys um, exactly what's going on. So this is the infrastructure bill. It's a $1 trillion infrastructure bill. Um, as you can see here, uh, they talk about new roads, um, electric uh, school buses and, and, and good stuff so, and bridges. But I'm going to take you guys down to the part where I want to focus on in this video. So uh, if you can see here, I'm going to highlight this if you can show on the screen. Um, so electric cars, buses and ferries. So if you see here, so they've actually given an additional $7.5 billion for um, the nation's first network of electric vehicle chargers along highway. So this is huge because, again, I've been talking about stocks like ChargePoint, Bling, um, and the other stuff here on the channel. I t keep telling you guys, like, these stocks, if this infrastructure bill ever went through, these are the stocks that are going to benefit the most. And so this is going to be our focus. So I'm going to do a video. Um, in this video, we'll talk about uh, our top charging stocks that you should be putting in your in your portfolio or on your watch list right now. And then I'm going to do a separate video on the electric bus stocks that I'm, I'm going to be buying. And then um, for ferries, I haven't done any, re any research on that. I don't really know any companies that do ferries. So I might uh, do some research, but um, no guarantees that I'm going to do a video on that one. But uh, so this is going to be our focus. So you have electric vehicles, you have electric charging stations, uh, and then you have electric buses. So all those is a combination. And then the other piece that the people don't really talk about that impacts this electric vehicle is lithium. So we're going to do our top lithium stocks. So from that perspective, what are the top charging stocks that you should be looking right now? It's going to jump right in. So the first one, of course, is charge point for those of you that know charge point um again the stock that we'll cover here most recently i did a video telling you guys charge point when it dipped down to like 19 dollars and was like hey buy 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 because this is a great entry point and um i mean this infrastructure bill came out and look at what happened to charge point so this is charge point gapping up now up sitting somewhere around 20 27.90 which is crazy if you can just go back here just within uh the past month or so Look at where charge point came down to to 19 bucks and it's now squeezed back all the way to 28 uh and there was some people even on the channel that were making fun when i posted that video that or oh, you called it you said it was going to go up it's pulling back it's like be patient with the market guys and infrastructure bill just came in and make it even better so that's number one charge point number two is bling charging Pretty much the same business model. And again, guys, if you don't know the business model for all of these companies, definitely go do some research. Just read about them. Go to their website. Just read a little bit um, before you jump in and invest. So Bling is obviously on that list. And as of when we're doing this video, look at Bling sitting at uh, $40. So if we go back here one month, same thing. Bling came down to $28. Uh, right here, $27 and some change. And this bill, look at $31 to $40. It just went crazy. Um, or close to 50%, which is insane. So that is, I mean, for, for the month, just for this month, is up close to 50%. So that's number number two. Number three is EVgo. Um, EVgo is a smaller one, but I still like it because it's um, cheaper, but has high potential. Because if charge point, I mean, we're talking about 500,000 charging um, stations across highways in the United States. There's a lot of highways in the United States. So 
I don't think that one company is going to be able to benefit from that. It's going to be a shared effort. So you're going to have different contracts going to ChargePoint, going to Bling, going to EVgo. So this will be something that it would go across the board. So uh, these guys are obviously on that list. So put them, if you can see here, look at where they were trading just about a month ago. This is October 18. That was seven bucks. And now we're talking about close to tested $14, which is that's double. Um, your investment. So again, these are ones that you see potential if we continue in this um, green uh, energy direction. So this is going to be a huge one for, for us. So again, definitely um, go to the website, check out EV Gold, read about the company and look at what they are doing. But the catch here for one, the elephant in the room that I want you guys to be aware of is Tesla. Uh, we know for sure that Tesla is, I mean, this big dog and they've been doing their thing for years um, and their charging stations were specific to Tesla. But now Tesla is opening their charging stations to other uh, electric cars, which is going to even increase their profitability. Um, I think it's, it's a business model that most people didn't even see coming. So now you can go to Tesla with your Toyota or with your Prius or whatever you want to bring there. You can charge it at their charging stations. I think it's unique. Uh, you can charge your Tesla, you can charge other ones. So they collect that revenue. And so right now they're doing a pilot phase um, out in, I think in the Netherlands in, uh, in Holland. So they're going to do that pilot phase. And then once they see like, hey, this is, uh, this makes sense. Then they can start spreading that across, um, you know Europe or even the United States and, and in Asia everywhere that they have Tesla cars so keep an eye on Tesla as far as your charging network so um, last but not the least the one that I didn't even put on my I didn't put here but I just put you can go look it up to is uh, EV box so EV box is actually currently in the process of going public uh, through a merger with uh, TPG so again that's another one they didn't really see a spike today but just check check out EV box that's another slipping uh, one that can benefit not at the same level as ChargePoint or Blink or EVgo, but obviously um, in a low entry one where the price is still relatively cheap with a, a, a huge upside for for the most part. So definitely go out and take a look at um, uh, at those. So so when it comes to EV stocks, guys, again uh, I I try to give you guys. Uh, my play. I've actually explained how the whole ecosystem works in my brain, the way I've actually put everything together. So EV is not just uh, one play. It's a whole series of plays coming together to make it happen. So you start from mining lithium. We need to be in lithium mining companies. Again, I'm going to do a separate video on that one. We want companies that make batteries. So we want to be in that space. Companies that use those batteries to build cars. And then companies that are potentially going to be charging these cars. Again, like the one we just talked about today. And then finally, companies that are going to recycle that lithium once these cars expired or once these cars get old. So that's the game plan for the EV thing. So we're, we're going to make a ton of money if we follow this plan through. So again, I'm going to do a separate video uh, coming up here for the different uh, stocks that I'm watching in those different um areas that I just mentioned. So again, let me know in the comment section. If you're new here, we talk about how to earn money, how to save money, how to invest and build wealth. So that's something that interests you. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content. Also guys, if you're looking to get started with investing, Webo has your promotion where if you sign up and deposit $5, you get free crypto. I think you're giving out free $5 worth of Shiba and you get free stocks as well. Links in the description. And as always guys, do your due diligence. Don't be a greedy savage. Stay motivated.